You know, there's so many great restaurants in New York, maybe more than any place, and whenever I'm here, I like to eat, I like to try something new. So there's a restaurant in the East Village called The Black Ant. It's been getting a lot of attention. I wanted to try it, but I didn't want to go alone, so I invited my young nephews who live here, my cousin Christy and my cousin Jimmy's kids, to join me on a culinary adventure. We made a reservation, and Guillermo and I took the kids out for dinner and a surprise. Here it is. Yep. Right through there. Welcome to the Black Ant. Here's your table, follow me. Thank you very much. Here you go. Thank you. All right. Welcome. This is a Mexican food restaurant. Do you like Mexican food? I like some of it. Mm -hmm. I like tacos. You like tacos? Yeah. Okay. Guillermo, do you I like? I love Mexican food, You like yeah. Mexican food? Yes. Okay, yeah. How are you guys? Welcome to Black Ant. Hello, Jimmy. How are you? Hello, Hello, Jimmy. My name is Mario Hernandez. I'm the chef of uh, Black Ant Restaurant in West Village. We prepared tonight for you guys a little uh, tasting menu. We hope you guys enjoy it. This We're is one of the best restaurants in New York. So this is gonna be a great meal. Yeah. Thank you. Hope you enjoy it. So we're gonna start, guys, with our guacamole. Yeah. And some black and salt. What is that? Black and salt. Those are black ants? Yep. Uh, our restaurant is a Mexican place, uh, and we use a lot of insects and in, uh, some of our dishes. Thank you. We just eat those right there on the chips, right? Yes. Very good. Enjoy. Dig in, fellas. I thought that we were going to go out to get burgers or something like that. It winded up to be that we were going to have ants and bugs for dinner. I am not eating the black ants. This. What do you mean? I don't want to. I mean, that's the whole thing here. Well, it's, all right, guess I'll try it. Yeah, just have a little, just all experiment. Right. You like it? What do you it's think? It's an odd taste, but very good. Mm hmm There you go. Um, it's all right. The ants really get stuck in your teeth, you know? Yeah. When people hear I'm related to Jimmy Kimmel, they think, oh, that's so cool. But now, like, they'll see it's not that cool. This is your second course, guys. Oh, that looks good. Cured watermelon with Jamaica jelly. Uh-huh. Some grasshoppers. Oh, grasshoppers. Yep. You guys like grasshoppers? Never tried before. All right, dig in. Yeah. I guess we can just pick this up, right? Yeah. What do you think? Eat it. This is honestly, like, my worst nightmare. It's good. Mateo, what do you think? You like that one? <laughs> Everybody all right? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> I can't believe I put a jacket on for this. I may throw up one. Good. Open big. <laughs> what do you yeah. think about adults who would come to this restaurant and spend a good amount of money to eat here? Crazy. It seems crazy to you. I can't wait to see what's next. I, I don't know what I'm Maybe it'll be a soup with flies in it. And yeah, we can say, waiter, that. there's a fly in my soup. And he'll go, I know. <laughs> oh, here this we go. Agave worm taco with cichito peppers. Worm tacos. Oh, yeah. Cichito tacos, peppers yeah. and some uh, calamari in tortilla. You say you got light taco, you told me. Thank you. Do you like worm tacos? No. How do you know? I have a feeling I'm not going to. You have a feeling? Yes. <laughs> I'll have the first bite. What do you think about that? All right, guys? Okay. Here we I go. I don't even want to. You guys are going to love it. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll give it a try. Mm -hmm. Just don't think about it. Just go for it. That's how Guillermo eats. He didn't think about it. He just... Don't forget the worms. Get, make sure you get some worm in there. That's what really gives it the zing. Crunchy. Crunchy, oh, mm. nice. Mm. What do you think, Mateo, you love it? <laughs> yeah. So let's recap. We've had ants, we've had grasshoppers, and we've had worms. Which do we like best? Ants. Ants? You know what we're gonna have for dessert? All right, what? We're gonna eat boogers. Uh, what? Human boogers for dessert. Sounds so good. 
What? I'm just kidding. We're not gonna have boogers for dessert. Oh my God. <laughs> so listen, I don't want the chef to feel bad about the food. So when he comes out, you guys, he should feel bad. <laughs> well, do me a favor. When he comes out, just tell him how much you loved everything, okay? okay. And be specific. All right? Okay. Yeah. How's he looking, guys? Well, I think I'll let these guys speak for themselves. Mateo, what do you think? It's good. That's I, good? Very spicy. I, Where, I loved it. You loved it, yeah? The worm was just... I loved it, too. I loved the uh, worm. I like the ants. Mm -hmm. Especially the watermelon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, cool. very good. I'll definitely come back here with my parents. I know you will? Yeah. Great. Mm -hmm. Really, the best part was the water. But um, that, I guess you can say, the chips was the second best. Thank you. Guys. So these guys, I think you got some converts here. They really loved it. Thank you. Maybe they, you guys want more? No. Uh, I'm, I'm full. full. I'm full. You're full? Yeah. Okay. We'll come back. Guys? If Uncle Jimmy wants to have a good time with his nephews, like, go to the water park. You guys want to get out of here? You should get out. Yeah. Guillermo, you get the check. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> Who wants some ants on their pizza? No. They're black. They're the kind you guys like. No. A little bit? No. No? Isn't it fun when Uncle Jimmy comes to town? No. No? <laughs> I, I had fun. So there they are. <laughs> Joseph Mateo, Thomas and James. Well done, fellas. You know what? Maybe tomorrow night we'll go out and eat a rat. What do you think? <laughs> all right, all right. If you like that video, click the subscribe button, but only if you're ready for commitment.